this, Father. Talk to me. Let me hear how mystified you are by my anger. Dorian, there's no need to. I prefer the company of men. My father disapproves. That's a big concern in Tevinter, then. Only if you're trying to live up to an impossible standard. Every Tevinter family is intermarrying to distill the perfect mage, perfect body, perfect mind. The perfect leader. It means every perceived flaw, every aberration is deviant and shameful. It must be hidden. I'll need you to explain that. Did I stutter? Men and the company thereof, as in sex. Surely you've heard of it. I've more than heard of it, actually. No. The Herald of Andraste. <laughs> I am shocked and scandalized. <laughs> Such sarcasm. You're not exactly subtle, O oh Lord Inquisitor. Of course not. I should have known that's what this was about. No. You don't get to make those assumptions. You know nothing about the Inquisitor. Go off, Dorian. This is not what I wanted. I'm never what you wanted, Father. Or had you mind? Those are his words. But what was the first thing you did when your precious heir refused to play pretend for the rest of his life? You tried to change me. I only wanted what was best for you. You wanted the best for you. Your fucking legacy. Anything but that. Poor Dorian. I only wanted to talk to him, to hear his voice again, to ask him to forgive 